The next seven star terror raid event for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet has just been announced. We're going to cover all of the details in today's video. So on the back of the seven star Typhlosion and Blissey Spotlight terror raid events ending, we have had the announcement for our next seven star terror raid event and it comes as a big surprise. Hot off the press, Cerebi is on it as always. We've got the announcement that it will be Inteleon, which will be the next seven star terror raid Pokemon happening this coming Friday in Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. It will have the Ice Terra typing tied to it, so a bit of a unique typing, something that we haven't seen before. Like I say, it will be running from April the 28th until the 30th. That'll be the first phase of this event. And then it'll be returning to our games from the 5th of May running through to the 7th. So we'll have two opportunities to battle this Pokemon, catch it, of course. The details on this up to now are pretty sparse and uh, we don't have much information. The Japanese website hasn't updated as of yet. But as we know from other seven star terror raid events, it will have the mightiest mark. It will be level 100. It will have the ice terror typing tied to it. And you'll only be able to catch one of these per save file. So it's a pretty nice event. Not one that I was expecting. Like I say, we put a poll up on the channel at the start of the weekend asking you all what Pokemon you thought would be coming in the next seven star terror raid. And this was not one of the options, but another eighth generation starter joining the Scarlet and Violet Pokedex, which is very exciting. Obviously we've had Cinderace already now and Teleon joining the ranks and you're likely to get Rillaboom very soon. What starter Pokemon we'll get after that is anyone's best guess, but I'm hoping for things like Infernape, Empoleon, obviously Blastoise, Venusaur would be really cool. If we get them, they're not on the game data, but I'm pretty sure that we will get those Kanta starters at some point along the line. But what we'll get before we get home compatibility, of course, is anyone's best guess, like I've already mentioned, and hopefully home does come soon, but we look like we're gonna get a bunch of starters and these are coming thick and fast every single week so this is the next one obviously it will be coinciding with that walking wake and iron leaves terror raid event that will be coming back for those players that had the issues with the bad egg from the latest 1.3 update but the Inteleon is going to be a lot of fun. Of course, we will be doing a best builds video for this later this week, going over the best Pokemon to help you prepare for this raid coming up. So do keep an eye out for that one. But a very quick update today, just to let you know that this will be the next raid event that will be happening in our games later this week. If you found today's video useful, please drop a like. Do subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all of our latest Pokemon Scarlet and Violet content, as well as our best builds videos, which go over some of the best options to go into these raids and help you beat them first time solo in your game or online. Thank you so much for tuning in, friends. Let me know down in the comment section below what your thoughts are on Inteleon joining the ranks of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, and I will see you all in another video very soon. So until then, friends, take care of yourselves and bye-bye.